And why is it important to have an, an important, uh, why is it important to have a, a strong gut lining? It's because you don't want to get gaps or holes in your planks because this is what leads to, you know, what some people call leaky gut. You get, you can get infiltration of pathogenic bacteria. You can get all the small molecules inside your gut that are supposed to stay there leaking into your gut, your, your bloodstream. And so you get this heightened inflammatory response, these undesired immune responses. And so essentially your gut lining becomes a really important part physiologically of your health. And a lot of people who don't have that strengthened gut lining feel it in you know, GI distress, so very sensitive to certain foods, but they also feel it in terms of inflammation. We actually have dermatologists who are using acromancia for things like atopic dermatitis and eczema because what they're finding is that um, when you have this heightened inflammatory response because your gut lining, you know, at the core is actually not uh, the way it should be, it shows up on your skin as, uh, you know, a skin disorder. And, and you know, a lot of the treatments for skin are, um, what I like to think of like in your car when your check engine light comes on. It's like if you were to put a piece of tape on that check engine light and be like, all right, I solved that. So a lot of the skin uh, remedies are just topicals that go on the skin when in fact, actually you should be checking your engine, which in this case is your microbiome, which is causing these heightened inflammatory responses. So, so because the gut lining is so important and because sugar regulation is so important, acromancia is, is super important. It plays these two different roles. Makes a lot of sense.